dog in here? Rock hard. What are you yelling at? Oh, did you find a book? Oh, books are awesome, dude. Especially because you're not going to school. You've got to read lots of books so you can get smart so you can go to school. Wait, are you supposed to go to school to get oh, smart? I don't know. Mom. But you should read books because they're awesome. Hey, Rock Tard. Want to say hi to everybody? Say good morning. 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 He did not wear these pajamas last night. He woke up this morning and said, I want to wear these pajamas. So that's why he's wearing pajamas today. It's almost lunchtime and he's still in his pajamas. And you know what? I don't care. Because we're home just partying while the kids are at school. Actually, Rocktar, do you want to show them what we're doing? Yay! Yay! Let's go show them what we're doing in the bathroom. Want to go show them? No. You just keep reading your books and get smart. I'll go show them, okay? Okay. In the bathroom, it's been, how long have we lived here? June, since June. And I'm finally putting some pictures up. Yeah! What do you think? Isn't that kind of pretty? And that's from, or I've had that one for a while. It's moved from house to house. And I got these at Ross. They were super duper cheap, like 10 bucks. And um, yeah, I'm going to get this one up there somehow. It is actually taking me a long time. I'm kind of slow at it because I'm a perfectionist. I want it to be exactly straight. It can't be tipped at all. It has to be exactly two inches in 74 millimeters right. Anyways, I'm a little bit of a perfectionist. So let's go hang this. And we'll see how it turns out. What is this? Rock Tard found a new game. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> wow. Cool, dude. Is that your new game? <laughs> I've been in the girls' room putting together a shelf and putting up a mirror, and I came out here and rocked hard, got into the dishes, he found the cupboards, found the pots and pans, and he found the rolling pins. We have four rolling pins. I don't know why we have four rolling pins. I think I got them so that when we make roti and we make cookies and stuff, everybody has a rolling pin because everybody's always fighting over the rolling pins. I know how people love rolling pins. Let's see your game. Oh, man. i got to get all these rolling pins back. Over. I don't want to have to make two trips. Ugh, fine. I guess I'll make two trips. Okay, I'm going to line them all up in a row. Good job, dude. Look at you. you got a system going on for this new game you found out. Okay, let's see it. Oh, man. Whoa! Whoa, look at that. <laughs> I love it. You guys, you don't need to buy your kids expensive toys. Just get them a few rolling pins, and they'll be happy. Yeah! What what game is this called, Rocktard? Oh my gosh, that one was fast! Wow! <laughs> Go one. Yeah! Good job! High fives! High fives! <laughs> or head five, that works too. All right, you guys, school just ended. We got our homework done. I always say we, as if I had homework. I always have homework, though. I have three sets of homework to help with, right? <laughs> you guys have pretty easy homework so far. All right, so we're starting our new, our new system of the year is come home from school, homework done, have a little bit of snack, and then you start on the chores, okay? Okay. Are you guys excited? Are you guys are super duper excited no, I hate chores? Well, um, oh, I don't hate laundry. Oh, no. <laughs> so we decided these are the chores that we're going to have. This is August, and it's Wednesday. We're starting on Wednesday the 15th. We've got laundry, vacuuming, and bathroom. This is going to be folding laundry, putting a load in. This is going to be basically the front room and the kids' bathroom. So three jobs. Rockstar doesn't have one yet, obviously, because he's the one that makes all the messes. That's his chore. What are you guys giggling about? What is going on down here? I'm so excited. I'm excited that you guys are so enthusiastic about doing chores. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> We've got the stars right here. That is it. That is it. You want to tickle? I'll show you tickle. I'll show you tickle. You guys are crazy. All right, you guys ready to get some chores in? Oh, the star system. We got sun tards blue, 
Rock Tart is green. He doesn't have any chores. He's just a booger. And Baby Tart's orange. Princess Tart is red. I don't have So any. they all they they all picked Look. which one they're gonna do. Look what happened, Mom. Oh no, I guess I guess that Princess Tart doesn't have to do any chores since her name's not up there. Yay! <laughs> yeah, right. JK L O L. <laughs> Let's go do our chores, guys. Princess Tart? <laughs> um, looks like you're getting some work done. Mommy! <laughs> Honey, you can use a stool, you know that, right? <laughs> you fucker. <laughs> How's it going? Are you getting any laundry done there? Or are you just playing in the washing machine? I'm trying to get the wet stuff to put in this! <laughs> Well, if you would like a stool, you can use a stool, you know. <laughs> Go do your okay. chore, you crazy. We gotta crack the whip. We've got Tangled on. We love listening to Tangled while we're working. Princess Jard. What? You really are doing a great job. You've already gotten all the dry clothes out. Oh, there's a lot. You're gonna have a lot of folding to do. Sorry about that. You are too. Well, I know. We'll have to work together. For sure. This is Baby Tard's first experience with vacuuming. And she's already tangled herself up. But we can do it. All right, let me show you. First of all, let's get rid of this. Okay, you're gonna hold this with your left hand. Hold that, that cord with your left hand this way, like this. Like this. Like this. There you go, there you go, right there. All right, hold it like that so that you keep the cord out from under the brush of the vacuum, okay? Now wait, hold on, let me show you. You gotta take, hold, you're gonna hold this with your right hand. Right there. And then do you know how you tip the vacuum down? Look, watch, watch. You gotta do that. Okay? Cool? Now you're gonna hold it with this right hand, with this right hand, because you have seven right hands. Then you're gonna have to click both of these on, because this turns the vacuum on, this turns the brush on. Okay? You ready? Start moving it forward and back. Or back, or just back. That's cool too. <laughs> Good job, baby tired. Look, you're growing up so fast. Going to school and doing chores and everything. Good job, honey. Good job. <laughs> the vacuum's bigger than she is. Oh, what's that? Oh, peanut. Awesome, thank you. Okay, Baby Tart is the first to finish her chore of vacuuming the front room. So look, you get to pick an orange star and you get to put it up there where it says Wednesday. High five, dog. Give it up. Proud of you. Yeah. <laughs> Proud of you too. You look like you did your chore of working out. Dude, I was, I've been out mowing the countryside. <laughs> I mowed southeastern California. Sweet. That's a big job. <laughs> that was cool. It's like a new scarf. It's a new style. Check it out on a shape girl that time. It's a banana scarf. I did it. Good job. She's folding my underwear. <laughs> Good job, honey. It. Good job. <laughs> okay, baby tard. Put it down there on Wednesday under the 15th, right? There. Here? Yep. Good job. That's one down. Can you come help me with go. the toilet? The toilet? Yeah. Okay, let's go. I let's go see what I you've did. done so far. I'm excited. Oh my goodness! Oh, it's so shiny! I can see my face in the mirror! And that is all clean. Good job! It looks good so far. Are you just doing the toilet? Yeah. Alright. Can I eat off that toilet seat? Ew! You I'm done it. it. Yeah, We're gonna test it right now. Ew! You probably shouldn't do that anyway. Ew! <laughs> it smells like bleach. Dude, I love bleach. Bleach is one of my favorite smells. Ew. Ew. Bleaches and tennis balls. Dude, if you bleached a tennis ball... That's not bleach. the best smell ever. Clean? I, it just reminds me of cleanliness. It, Dude, yes. have a hug? Yeah, don't. Don't sniff Give me a hug. Why don't you love your daddy? Mm. <laughs> Careful, dude. <Jesus. laughs> you stay. Don't sniff bleach, kids. It's not good for you. <laughs> Golly.
Sorry, sound of music. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're having leftovers from our uh, Shea Loss recipe. That's the good thing about making these things. You can have leftovers. If you didn't see it, there's a link. Oh, Bam! Right. And uh, we're having leftovers of that and leftover spaghetti and a new salad. It's leftover night! Maybe Wait, after we eat, because okay. Daddy's going to need to burn us off, because I went on a 33-mile bike ride today, so I'm eating lots. How was school? Good. What did you learn? Let me go get my journal. Good. I learned, I learned to, how to play with the toys nice, and we don't just shove them in back and, then, and we... Um, did you learn that, or did you already know that? No, we um, played with the toys, and we did what we're supposed to like do with them. But I'm, what I'm trying to say is, I okay. already taught you that, right? Like, give your dad some credit. Like, <laughs> okay. I want some credit for some things that you know. Like, I taught her, you guys, I promise, I taught her not to shove the toys and to play nicely. I, that's one thing I taught her. Sundar, what'd you learn? I learned about an Olympian named Jesse, Jesse Owens. Owens. Cool, he's an one of the Olympian greatest Olympians ever. And he run. He ran. He ran 1913 and to 1980. Oh, those and are the years that he ran? Or that's probably where he, that's how long he lived, and probably. He Dang it. And <laughs> that's a long time to run. We, re we read a story called I Elmer the Elephant, and it's about just be yourself and don't be someone you're not. Perfect. And we did. He wrote this down. This is great. He wrote all the things that they went over in school down in his journal. Because I said in yesterday's vlog, you better know what you learned when you come home because daddy's going to wonder. The teacher wrote all the Olympic, the sports that you use in the Olympics. And yeah. We picked a favorite one and I picked diving. Really? That was your favorite one to watch is diving? Maybe we should start doing some diving. There's two yeah. people I know that watch our videos. Their name is Suntard and Baby Tart. And I learned how to draw like tigers, pigs, cats. Cool. A princess that they do for a baby daughter on her birthday. Oh, nice, and nice, I'm nice. Gonna what? I'm going to do show and tell. Okay, right now we're at school. At school. What are you going to bring? A Barbie and a... Dude, what are you doing? You're still in your pajamas, you lazy butthead. You haven't done anything today. These kids have been out earning a living, making a wage, getting some knowledge, and you've just been screwing around in your pajamas all day watching Thumbelina. And I got... A Jackson Harris CD. You no, did? No, uh, James Blunt. And She's and gonna dad. show her James Blunt CD. Oh, you're gonna show your James Blunt yeah. CD. That's a good show and tell. She's gonna give it to the teacher. And huh? show a book. That's a good idea. You could say, hey everybody, this is why I'm cooler than all of you because I'm on a nationally selling CD. <laughs> no, that's not what you're gonna say. <laughs> Don't say that. I'm not gonna say that. Just be <laughs> humble. Be humble. That's a good idea for show and tell though. Wouldn't that be cool? Kindergarten, like this is me on a CD. That's pretty cool. The kids will probably be like, oh, like so, so what? Uh, I hate James Blunt. <laughs> Sit in your own chair. This baby does not sit still for two, not even one second. He doesn't. All day long, he's jumping, moving, climbing, yelling, screaming, even, even premeditating when, murder, all yeah, kinds exactly, of stuff. Yeah, exactly. Seriously, all the time. Even when the kids were gone today, I kept finding him. He was in there, so I was in the bathroom, like, organizing stuff. He was in there for a little while, like, playing with the stuff on the bed. And then he was in his room, playing with his toys. And it was just cute to watch him play by himself. Get down, dude. Just because you're cute doesn't mean you can get away with anything. Which he does, because he just gets to do whatever he wants to. What'd you do at recess, dude? Play kickball. Kickball? How far did you get when you kicked the ball? Uh, kind of like, so this is the... I mean, like, which base? Oh. Um, I didn't really kick it that far, even though I tried, and then I got to first base. First base, cool. <laughs> I thought you told me you got to third base. Well, yeah, but that was the first day. Oh. This is the second day. What's up, um, you, Miss Princess Hart? I um, I went to the little play area and I played with blocks, oh. like these big blocks. Um, there's like this little quiet area where we can do anything during recess. We, yeah. And we Did you have a friend that you played with? Mm -hmm. Her name is Esme. Is she cool? She's nice. Good. Um, she plays me every recess. Baby Tar, do you got any friends? Um, I One. One? You got Madison. Oh, cool. <laughs> so you guys are liking school then? Guess what? You liking it? I think I love the... <laughs> I have the best teacher ever. Shout out to the Teach Teach. 
you. A girl in my class named Jasmine. Mommy, bye. Eat that tomato, Mama. It gets broccoli and tomatoes. Hold on. Faster. Eat it faster. Give her another one. Eat it faster. Eat it faster. <laughs> I thought about him. He loves feeding people. He likes to like. He always like will share. He likes stuff and people he things in people's eat. mouths. Feed me like feeding people. And then he just kept shoving tomatoes down her face until she turned into a tomato. I've got a blueberry for a daughter. Violet, you're turning violet. Violet. It was a tomato, not a blueberry, honey. Oh right, and then when they had the gum, she had delicious tomato soup. I can feel it actually running down my throat. Mmm, here comes the next course. Name that movie, you freakoids. Freakazoids. Bet you know, because we quote lines from it every other day. We really do. That's probably the most quoted Shaytard movie, movie quote. Movie quote. Is and I'll ask you this, and I've asked this question, and this will go out to some of you who have been watching for a long time. When they have the fizzy lifting drink, what do you imagine it tastes like? Now, if you answer correctly, you will win a large a lifetime supply of tomatoes and chocolate. Chocolate tomatoes. That's how you knew you wanted to be with me forever, because I got that answer right. Remember? Wait, yep, true, true, <laughs> very true. But listen, you like tomatoes, you like chocolate. Have you ever considered, like, chocolate-covered cherry tomatoes? Would those be good? I kind of think that would be good. Yeah, that, I wouldn't mind trying that. Who's done that? Anybody do some chocolate covered cherry tomatoes? Huh? Huh? Send me a link. Send me a link. Hey, check out uh, the podcast, the Baby Tard podcast, because she's hilarious and the worst guest ever. <laughs> she made a giant mess. And I told her that Roth is going to break both of her legs if she's not careful. So go check out uh, Baby Tard podcast. Check out the Shea Loss recipe. That's in a link somewhere. Somewhere in the air. Grab it. There it is. It's floating by you. Grab it. Oh, no. You missed it. Oh. Check out yesterday's vlog. It was a good one. First day of school. First day of school. You ain't cool unless you go to first day, first of, day school. of school. Kids wore their very first outfits. And I had a theory. Oh, mom's got a text message. I'm sorry. It's from Kaylee Dawn. Anyways, uh, guess what? You're awesome. Smile right now. Do it. Do it. Don't be too, like, no, I'm not going to smile. Smile as big as you can, like this. I'm so late. This makes me so happy. You look silly.